What's up loves, it's your girl April and today's video is going to be about a blonde styled bob, okay? So you girls know I don't really do too much blonde and I don't do too many bobs, but for today's video we're going to do just that. So this is by a company called Not Your Grandma's Wigs, which is NYGW. <laughs> My wig was set in this cute little box. It did come with one of one of my favorite caps, which I will share with you guys because I use these all the time to make my wigs, which is the Mesh Spandex Dome Cap. I love these. I'm not going to wear this under the wig because it just defeats the purpose, but I will be using it to make a wig with. So thank you, um, NYGW, for this here. So, this wig here is a 10 inch bob style wig. Now the one thing that I should have done is I should have chose the density, um, meaning you can choose the density. There's um, natural, there's Vavoom, and I'm not really sure what the other one was. So I just left it as nothing at all and it came to me in natural. And you girls know I like a lot of hair. Like, I like a lot of hair. It's no lie, I do. So yeah, I should have chose the Vava Boom. So it's a little thin for me. Maybe a bob is not supposed to be so full, but for me, I need it to be just, I need hair, lots of hair. So I did get the color that was on the website, which the model looked super pretty in. Now it is like a 27 and the roots are not 1B, thank goodness. It's more or less like a brownish red. Um, the one thing that I did notice is though, in the back area right here, it is a little tiny bit choppy when it comes to the blending, but maybe once you work your way around it, around it, if you curl it a certain way, it may not appear so. So it is a lace front. As you can see right here, there is lace only in the frontal area. There are three combs in the front and an adjustable strap in the nape area. So I've already went ahead and placed my part in it. And the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to use my favorite concealer palette which is from Beauty Treats for $5.99. I'll post where you can get that below, um, down below. And um, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and put some concealer that'll match my scalp just perfectly. Okay, ladies, so I'm going to style this wig to the best of my ability. First things first, got to take off the head wrap and situate myself. So this is a 10-inch lace front wig, all human hair. And the color blonde is a really pretty color. I do like a lot of less dark roots, meaning it's a little bit too dark or too much dark roots for me. You know me, girls. I am so particular about my roots, and I explain this in, like, a lot of my videos when it comes to the roots. I like about a half an inch just to seem like it's just growing out of my head so for the most part the wig was really easy to put on um, it is a little thin to me but like I said there are different densities that you can choose from and I should have paid a little bit more attention and went for the more fuller density which was the va va boom the model looked absolutely gorgeous in this va va boom texture or density I mean absolutely stunning so that's what drew my attention a lot to the wig. So first things first, I'm using my humongous barrel curling iron. This curling iron is so old and so cheap. I got this from Walmart like many moons ago. And it's really only good to style or curl certain texture hairs, meaning you're not going to be able to really curl kinky hair with this because it just doesn't get to that heat volume that you would like it to get. But for this particular hair, it is perfect for this because it is more or less on the silky side. Not so silky, but it's more or less on that side. So as for the ends, it's not dried out. The hair is not dried out at all. It's not dry, it's not hay-like. It really curls easy. Um, being that it's a bob and I didn't want any tight curls, it's super, super duper easy to curl because I don't need like a lot of curls in this particular unit. But yes, ladies, loving this unit. Very, very pretty and I'll put their website below so that you can check them out and let me know what you think of them. And let's continue styling this wig and see what the finish looks like.
Okay, my love. So, finished styling this bad boy. I had to use my big barrel curler because I wanted some loose waves. I'm just really basically trying to give this wig some volume. I really wish I would have ordered it in more density so that way I could be totally happy. But I will tell you this. I do like this blonde a lot. It was very well mixed with the actual darker brown, but I wish they would have blended it in a little bit better. That's just my number one concern. I don't like as much blonde or as much dark roots but for bob this is basically really well but i'm really happy that i tried it out because i don't really do the bobs i don't do the bobs at all i don't really do hair that's this short especially if it's a bob because i just feel like my head is a little bit too long for that um but yeah so not your grandma's wigs they got some badass wigs on their website if you're looking for a gray wig they've got that they've got a lot of ones with different colors but very pretty style so it's a new website not your grandma's wig, something totally different, different name. You're not going to hear this name but on any other website, but I will totally agree with them. This is not your grandma's wigs. Very well constructed. I would say for the natural, if you're wanting more hair, then I would not go for the natural. I would go for the va-va-boom because it actually, that's what the model looks like she was wearing. It was very full and just looked so pretty on her. Just like, that's what just drew my attention. Like, you know what, April? I'm about to get this and rock it. But for the most part, you know what? I love their customer service, their packaging. They're very, very community. Their communication is very well. So, yes, give them a check out. Try them out. I will post their information for you girls below for this look here as well as their actual website let me know what you think of me with the bob on is it like totally different like totally totally different but on that note stay diva and divalicious and i'll check you girls out on my next video